In this video, we are going to explain the use of roles in Neuron. Since Neuron's 121 version, the management of roles and users has been improved to make configuration much easier for users. You can now easily create a user and assign them to different roles, according to the permissions they will be granted. Users can perform different roles without restrictions and every user can have as many roles as needed. The permissions for each role are provided in the access section of the web UI, web vision, and REST API server modules. It's important to have a good idea of the different roles in your project, and how they affect the security of your project. For instance, what level of access a particular module needs may determine the functional type roles that you create, and the different users assigned to each role. Due to the fact that version 121 includes a considerable modification when it comes to managing users and roles, upgrading from a previous version will automatically override all users previously configured for the web UI and web vision. This means that you will be required to recreate them. The first step when configuring a role, is to go to the config section in system and choose roles. By default, administrator and user roles are already created during installation. Next, click the button on the left-hand side of model to create a new role. Once created, you can add a description for the new role. In this example, I'm going to enable full permissions. Then, navigate to a module such as Web UI, Web Vision, or REST API server to assign the corresponding permissions. For this example, we've chosen Web UI to display the configuration. Click on Access within Web UI in the Modules section. Once inside, click on the button on the left-hand side of Model again, and in this case, we're going to add the role we previously created. Now that we've added the role, we can assign the corresponding permissions that the role should have in Web UI.